two old rivals that know each other well through the years in this 134th meeting between Virginia and Wake Forest. Last time, all it took was a last second bank shot from three to decide our winner. Do we have similar theatrics tonight? Well, time will tell. 46% so far this season for Beyond the Arc. Wilkins pulls up and he splashes the baseline jumper from the left side. Now Shayok had a look at it three steps inside the arc and fires away and he connects for the second time tonight, this time from the opposite wing left. Works around the hard hedge from Salt, passes to Minute Blue. He flicks the wrist, three-pointer did not touch anything but net. Cavaliers with a basketball in the front court. Mariel Shayok defended at the top of the arc by Woods. He'll feed to Parentes on the left wing. Now to Wilkins, pulls up just inside the arc and he cans one from the left baseline. Feeds it into the streaking Parentes who takes it down the lane and lays it in with an easy finger roll. Trying to probe inside, get some paint touches. Parentes catch and shoot three from straight away and he knocks it down. London with his first long one of the night. He's got five points and Virginia's back to within one. With a combination of Wilkins, Thompson, Reuter along with Jerome and Guy. Here's a straight on three and Arians knocks down his first one of the night. Three three-pointers made already for Wake Forest here in our opening half. Here's Jerome with a soft floater off the window and good, just left of the lane. Here's Hall at the top of the arc feeding off to Wilkins. He uncorks a three, and that one goes down. Well, he's got the hot hand. So here comes a drive inside. That's Woods missing the runner on the teardrop. Ball picked up off the floor above a bunch of players on the ground. Parentis feeds ahead to Shayok. Shayok takes it all the way on the other side and lays it in with a foul. Trying to find someone to get rid of it to. Now he feeds it to Salt. Nice backdoor feed to Shayok, who snakes his way down the lane and lays it in on the reverse side of the rim. Crawford, long three. That is an air ball, and it went right to McClinton. McClinton couldn't get the shot off in time, and there was no reset of the shot clock. So it is a shot clock violation. Wake Forest is led by as many as four. Here's a backdoor feed. Nice setup from Hall to Shayok, who lays it in after Hall threaded the needle down low. Wilbekin, a bounce pass the other way, sends to Crawford, late closeout, contact, he hits it with the foul. Here's a near turnover, it will be poked away and taken by Parentes, gets ahead of Crawford and lays it off the window and good on the reverse side. Second half of GPJ, Parentes takes a feed from Shayok, he fires away from three and he rattles it through. Dribbles with the left hand, now feeds it over to the left side, Wilbekin with five seconds left, puts the shot up, rejected by Wilkins as it comes down. Now sends it to Wilbekin. Wilbekin feeds Crawford, puts up a shot. It was contested, but hits it anyway from 17 despite the outstretched arm of Mariel Shayok. So Wake Forest back out in front. Wilkins, Diakite, Parentes, and Thompson. Parentes unloads on a three from a couple steps behind the arc straight away, and he swishes it through. Thompson has it on the left wing, feeds it to Salt, gets it back, hoists one up from three, and he knocks it down from the near corner. Big bucket there for Thompson, his first points of the night. And Virginia goes back ahead 43 to 40. 12.04 to play here. Regulation, Thompson once more puts up another three from nearly the same spot, and he buries another. To Crawford, Crawford's into the front court, chance to tie or get the lead with a three. Sends underneath to Collins, who powers it in underneath. We are even again. Thompson shovels into the corner. Hall unloads on a three, and he tickles the twine from the deep corner right. Thompson goes around the Salt screen, pulls up, can't get the shot, but Salt there for the throwdown on the putback with a foul. <laughs> and the little pepper, Salt Pepper. Big Jack Salt playing with some reckless abandon. Just before he zips a pass over to Hall in the corner. Hall attacks inside, glides right past Middleton, or rather Arians for the easy lay-in. Into the front court, Woods sees an opening, runs to it. It closes in a hurry on the fifth block of the night from Isaiah Wilkins. Virginia comes away with a basketball going the other way. Feathers it back to Thompson with five to shoot. He'll send it to the corner. Parentes steps back, fires away from three, and he hits it with an arm in his face. London Parentes starting to cook here in the second half. He's got 20 points now. Cavaliers come away with it. Outlet feed ahead to Hall, who goes into the air for the reverse layup. Kisses it off the window, and here's a timeout from Wake Forest. So Shayok dribbles this one down and will throw one at the rim, and he hits it with the over. I have never seen a three-pointer go down like that. My goodness, he threw it as though he was passing to the rim, and it went in.
And with a final horn, Virginia will take the 79-62 win here tonight to snap the two-game ACC losing streak. They are even at two wins and two losses once again in Atlantic Coast Conference play with this win tonight.